2015, a little bit of a rough finish for you. You accidentally named the wrong woman contestant Miss Universe. Yeah, but you know, it turned really ugly. There were people that threatened your life. Yeah. After that, a lot of people said, oh, this is just a stunt to drum up publicity. So now that you've had time to, you know, there's distance from it now, how surreal was that for you? Well, I mean, you know, anybody that knows me, I mean, why would I do it for a publicity stunt? I mean, I ain't brag. I'm already famous. <laughs> you know? <laughs> I, don't, I don't want to be famous for that. Yeah, yeah. You know? I don't want to be famous for that. I would have never done that to another person. I would have never have done that to Miss Columbia intentionally. Yeah, yeah. You know, um, it was really... Yeah, but was... she, you had her on the show, you apologized, and mm -hmm. she forgave you, she said. She, she, yeah. she was a beautiful girl, yeah. man. It was, uh, it, was, it was interesting because that night, you know, look, I did what I was raised to do. My mother was a, a Sunday school teacher. My father was a coal miner. I just took... I'm the combination of those people. I'm a hard work, I'm a rough guy and tough, but I have a lot of faith. And so I just walked out there for Miss Philippines so we could get it right. But they knew the mistake they made. The person in the teleprompter was not the same person on the card. So I ain't stupid. I read the teleprompter. Oh, so the teleprompter really did say something different than the card. Oh, absolutely. That's uh... what I read. I can't read nothing that ain't there. I can't make this up. I did the whole show right, yeah. but it was okay. You know, yeah. and then the guy in my ear said something else. And so I said it. And then when I went in the back, nobody thought nothing was wrong. And we, a minute and a half, almost two minutes before they went, oh my God, we've made a mistake. We've got to do something, and nobody said what to do. So I walked back out there. Now, a lot of people could have came out there with me. <laughs> <laughs> no, my memory you know, is that you were kind of alone. Yeah, <laughs> that was like crazy. I should have been going. Everybody's screaming. was on you. Yeah, ain't nobody. The, the, the dude with the card could have came out there and went, okay, we did something different than rehearsal. We're sorry, <laughs> Mr. No, I went out there. And, you know, I ate. A lot of people did memes about me. You know, y'all was eating me up on that. <laughs> yeah, the internet, my kids was coming over the house going, social media king, what's up? <laughs> But you know what? Everything, it all worked out in the end. You did a Super Bowl com commercial, but you almost didn't do it. You almost said no to it. Why is that? Well, because, you know, the guy that called me originally and talked to me about doing the Super Bowl commercial, he wanted to, you know, look, I've already made the mistake. You, you, you can't make me feel any worse about yeah. it. Now, you mean I'm going to come out here and do a commercial for you and, and feel worse about it? I said no. So... I told them I wouldn't do it. And then they, they asked me again. I told them three times no. And then they told me how much they paid. And I said, okay. <laughs> <laughs> but it was a great commercial. Because, you know, I, I had a lot of creative input. So I put a little special stuff in there that I always wanted yeah, to yeah. do. You know, um, here so I So I go. heard rumors that you're going to host Miss Universe next year. Is that true? Or this year, I guess, now. Yeah, I'm going to do you it. You are. Year. You are. Okay. <laughs> somebody else to work the teleprompter. <laughs> Let me tell you something. This is what I've learned, Meredith, in my life. Behind every moment of adversity, two things happen. There's a lesson and there's a blessing. I don't care what adversity happens in your life. There are two things that come with it. I hung through the adversity to get through the blessing. Now, I learned. Now, next year, oh, trust and believe. <laughs> somebody gonna hand me the card and stand right there. <laughs> Oh, trust me. I will not be holding... Somebody gonna hand me a card. And every time I read, they gonna hand me a card. That's what I'm gonna do next time.